What's going on YouTube? Today we are showing you how to flash KitKat 4.4 KitKat for the Verizon Samsung Galaxy S3. This is an unofficial CM11 ROM called KitKang. I'll put the links in the description below. Um, it's run by DMeadows013. Obviously it's based off CyanogenMod Mod 11. I've been running KitKang on my S4 and with no problems. I mean, there are some bugs here and there, but it is a nightly. But it's, you know, it's nice to have it. So I haven't done it on my S3 yet. I'm going to do that now. And I'm going to show you how to do it. Uh, you have to have the latest recovery. I went through a long process of trying to update my recovery. I tried Goo Manager. It wouldn't work as of November 23rd. Um, I even downloaded ROM Manager and update Clockwork Mod and it gave me 5.8 whatever so I had to do it manually check out that video I'll show you how to do it it's real simple but I got the latest one 6.0.43 so we're going to do our normal thing uh, we're going to wipe data and then I like to go in and oops sorry I like the format system. Do not format your internal card, please. Go back. Wipe cache. Yes. And then we're going to wipe Dalvik cache. And I apologize if you've already seen this a million times. Advanced. Wipe Dalvik cache. And then we'll go back and we're going to install a zip from SD card. Yes. Oh, this is not the, I need to do. There we go. Unofficial eleven twenty two. Yes. That should get going. I had troubles using it before because I was using an old recovery. So I actually, actually haven't seen this work yet. I pray it works. Looks like it's working. And it said it was complete. Really? All right. We're going to do gaps now. Oh, I just did that. My bad. All right. We've got to make sure we get the right gaps. I have too many things on my phone. Kit Kang. Is that the right one? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm thinking of my S4. I apologize. Let's see what we got. Complete. All right. Let's reboot. Let's see what we got. Love that sound. That's a good sign. And there we go. I'm going to um, skip past all this. I'm going to sign into my Wi Fi and Google account, and we're going to get a first look at CM11 on the GS3. So hang tight guys. Okay guys, we're back up. Uh, this is what you come to after it's loaded, booted up. Uh, I'm going to ahead and skip past this part. But I just want you to see it. I did have to go back and reflash a different file, a different set of gaps. And I will put that link for those gaps that I did so it will work for you, okay? Well, let me go ahead and skip past this. Hang on a second. All right, we're back, 
and this is what you see after you sign into your Wi-Fi and Google account oh and as you can see that is working the uh, launcher is working that's kinda cool but I haven't set up Google now yet in order sorry I haven't set up the thing over there yet so I have to go into here it's not there where is it at? and you can turn that up that feature off if you don't like it I freaking love it but you know everybody's different so there it is and again if you want a <clears throat> different home screen just drag and there you go now you have three and from any screen you can say okay Google oh now I won't do it okay Google set alarm for 11 p.m. setting alarm that is cool so nice let's get into the settings here about phone you see 4.4 go ahead and do that little thing kick it kick it kick it sweet there it is it's <clears throat> 4.4 for the galaxy s3 guys looks nice i encourage you to check it out uh, let's see i don't know how much of the how many settings they got in there quick settings panel oh they got quite a few things in here you can change your tiles which is good I love that feature. If you turn it off, it's back to that. <clears throat> See what else we have. So I have the tiles. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. Oh, I like that too. That's cool. And we got themes that you can do function buttons power menu oh, custom before I would use a uh, double tap action to launch Google now but now we don't have to do that that's cool well, anyway guys that's just on how to how to on how to do it I have not used this obviously I have used it on my s4 and it it does work so I encourage you to check it out if you're a geek like me okay guys thanks for watching this video please feel free to share and comment on this video please hit that like button help me out and do me one more favor and have a blessed day guys